Hey guys, so in today's video, I'm going to show you how to transfer files from iPhone to Android using Zender. So if you want to send your file or a photo or a video from your iPhone to Android using Zender, let me show you a step-by-step -step guide on how to do that in today's video. So Zender is one of the fastest and easiest way to transfer files from your iPhone to your Android and vice versa. Let me, let's get started. First thing you need to do is head over to your App Store and Play Store and you need to download Zender to both devices. So here is how the apps look like. Once you have downloaded Zender to the two devices, you can now move to the next step. So if you want to transfer a photo or a video, you don't have to do this. But if you want to transfer a file, you need to move the file to Zender download. So I'm going to show you how to move the file to Zender download right now. So if you want to transfer from Android to iPhone, you don't have to do this also. But if you want to transfer files from iPhone to Android, you need to first move the file to Zender download. So in order for you to do that, open your files app and you need to copy the file. So let's look for the file. Let me go back to browse. I'm going to copy the file from this iCloud drive. So this is the file. Just long click on it and click on copy. Once you copy it, go back to your browse click on on my iPhone, click on Zender, click on others, and you need to click on download. Once you click on download, paste it right here. So once you have pasted it, let me delete these two files. So once you have pasted it, you can now go to the next step. So open Zender on the two devices. So once you open Zender, you need to receive on your iPhone. So you need to click on receive click right here and you need to click on receive and on your android phone you need to send so even though you want to send from android to iphone you need to send and if you want to send from iphone to android you need to send on android and receive on iphone so just click on got it and you need to select connect android so i'm going to send on my android device Once you send and receive on your iPhone, you need to scan the QR code on your iPhone. So click on connect Android at the top and scan the QR code. So once you scan the QR code, it's going to connect the two devices. So if it is a photo that you want to send from iPhone to Android, just go to the photo section right here and you need to send the photo that you want to send. So just select the photo. You can also select multiple photos and click on send. So it is very fast and reliable. As you can see, it is very fast. So that's how to send photo. If it is a video, go to this place. So sometimes you can find the video in this place or this place. I don't know why they separate it, but just check these two options and you are going to see your videos. So you can also send video, just select them and click on send. So if it is a file that you want to send right now, you need to go to this page. And as I have said earlier, you need to move the file to your downloads. So you are going to see download right here. Just click on download and you are going to see the file. So if you did not move the file to download, you are not going to see it on Zender. So as you can see, I have moved this one to download already. So you are going to see it on Zender. So just click on it. Make sure you click on this dot. You can also send multiple files. Just click on send and that's it. Very easy and straightforward. So if it is a music that you want to send, or audio you are going to find them right there so if it is from android to iphone just look for the file or the picture or the video that you want to send and click on send so it is very easy and straightforward so if it's a photo it's going to save automatically to your phone but if it is a video it's not going to save automatically to your phone so let me show you how to save the video as you can see i have transferred the video from my android to my iphone so let me show you how to save it if you want to save it, go to your sender files, go to your files, sorry, go to your files app on your iPhone, go back and you need to click on, on my iPhone. Once you click on, on my iPhone, click on sender and you need to click on order. Once you click on order, you are going to see the video right here. So let me go back. You are going to see the video right here. So if you want to save it, just long click on it and click on share. Once you click on share, you are going to see save video. So it's going to save to your photos app. You can also save it on the Zender application. So just head over to this page, to this page, sorry. 
just head over to this page and you're going to see the video so click on it and you're going to see save to album that's another method to save it so if you have any question about this drop them in the comments down below and don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel thanks for watching guys